Hi, this is Nancy Bergen reporting for Bass City Beat. Downtown Mount Clemens has plenty of attractions for people of all interests. But for all you art lovers, the DIA has brought in their own program, Inside Out. The Detroit Institute of Arts developed a program called Inside Out that brings masterpieces from the DIA's collection to the streets of Metro Detroit to engage residents in the appreciation of the artworks on display in the museum. The DIA's Inside Out program is meant to reach out to the entire metro area because I think the DIA realized that a lot of people just assume they're there and maybe don't make a visit. They don't think of it as their art center or their art institute. So they have they started Inside Out a couple of years ago. They actually put a piece here in downtown Mount Clemens a couple of years ago in front of the courthouse. But they expanded the program last year. So um, now what they do is they select uh, usually around a dozen communities each summer and then again kind of late summer. And each of those communities gets anywhere from seven to 11 reproductions. When the DIA announced Inside Out, we, we contacted them right away and we said we have to be a part of this. We have a fantastic walkable downtown. We already have a lot of public art installed. We have the Anton Art Center, which is very active and trying to get people involved in the arts. So we, we just, we jumped right on them and said, we have to be in this. This program is now in its third year, funded by a grant of $250,000 to the DIA from the John S. and James L. Knight Foundation. When they came out to talk about installing the pieces in Mount Clemens, we talked about what kinds of events we might host around the Inside Out program, and we settled on um, a kind of a, a moon and sun theme for our programs and so they gave us paintings that reflect the moon and the sun. So um, we have this piece where you can see the sun clouded in volcanic ash. Um, there are other pieces, there's one where a woman is dressed like Aurora, goddess of the sun. Uh, there are other pieces where the moon, and then they picked out other elements. So they picked pieces with water and wind. So they went for kind of this, this like, you know, forces of nature imagery. What is your favorite piece and why? This is actually my favorite piece, and I did not plan for us to be here. I was really glad when I heard that you guys wanted to interview me in front of this piece. I love the light in this piece. I think the way that the sun is shining um, and the colors that it brings out in the landscape, which is you know shrouded in all of this volcanic ash, the power of the mountain, the, the way you can see the wind blowing the ash, um, in this case, you know, to the west, but who knows what direction that is in the painting, I don't know. It's just, it's such a powerful piece and it's such an evocative landscape. It makes you feel like you're really there. I also love the way that this piece is situated. If you're sitting in Gus's eating at that row of tables, then, you know, look at your view. It's fantastic. So this is my favorite. I want to encourage everybody when you're down here checking out these pieces, a couple of them have these maps available. So the piece in front of the art center and the piece in front of the courthouse have brochure racks with maps in them. And the maps show you where all the pieces are located here in downtown Mount Clemens. And they also have a handy insert with all the activities that we have planned here for downtown Mount Clemens. And you can also get these maps on the Art Center's website, which is www.theartcenter.org. This program has created 80 reproductions in 12 communities. In downtown Mount Clemens, the Inside Out program runs from now until the end of June. So come out and see these beautiful works of art. For Bass City Beat, I'm Nancy Bergen.